We're told that Naomi lives at 2nd Avenue and 3rd Street, representing 2, 3 on the graph below. Her school is at 4th Avenue and 10th Street, representing 4, 10 on the graph. She walks over to 4th Avenue and up to 10th Street. Plot her home and school on the map. How many blocks does Naomi walk to school? So let's plot her home first. 2nd Avenue and 3rd Street, which they're giving us the coordinates 2, 3. So the x-axis right over here, this is, this is representing the avenues. And then the y-axis here, the vertical axis, this represents the street. So 2, 3. So this right over here, 2nd Avenue and 3rd Street. So you see here, we went to 2nd Avenue and then we went up to 3rd Street. This is where she lived at home. We could have also said 3rd Street and 2nd Avenue. Now, her school is at 4th Avenue and 10th Street. So 4th Avenue, and now we're going to go, so we, if we start at the origin, we go to 4th Avenue and then go up 10 to 10th Street. So this is the coordinate 4, 10. So this is where her home is. This is where her school is. They say she walks over to 4th Avenue and up to 10th Street. So she walks from 2nd Avenue to 4th Avenue and then up to 10th Street. How many blocks does Naomi walk to school? Well, as she walks from 2nd Avenue to 4th Avenue, she's going to walk two blocks. One block and two blocks. You shouldn't get confused by the, they're actually marking off with these lines every half a block. So that's one block to 3rd Avenue, two blocks to 4th Avenue. So that's two blocks so far. And then she goes from 3rd Street to 10th Street. Well, if you go from 3rd Street to 10th Street, that's going to be seven more blocks. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. So two in the horizontal direction and then seven in the vertical direction. So that's nine total blocks.